Hello, everyone. My name is Dr. Christina Madison, and I am here to chat about why it is so important to know how you can get HIV. So remember, this is something that can be transmitted via sex or from injecting needles from someone else who is HIV positive. You can't get it from a toilet seat. You can't get it from kissing. You can't get it from hugging. And more importantly, um, it's so important to make sure that you test. So if you are engaging in a sexual encounter with someone without a barrier method, it's really important to make sure before you have that encounter, if possible, to know their status and then also to know your status as well. So make sure that you're testing so that you know whether or not you're at potential risk for transmitting the virus to someone else, but then also making sure that you have access to clean needles if you are somebody who currently engages in injection drug use. So again, you can't just get HIV from, um, you know, touching something um, on an object or um, touching a substance. There has to be a way in. Um, as one of my favorite colleagues used to say, a sore is a door. So you definitely have to make sure that there is a way for the virus to get into your body, as well as that you're being exposed to one of the substances in your body that the HIV virus can be inside. So that includes blood seminal fluid, pre-seminal fluid, rectal fluid, vaginal fluid, and breast milk.